So how to use the properties and logs to expand the expression? Um, I have the three uh, log properties up here. It's irreversible with the ln, which are natural log properties. So I know this problem right here is in the natural log. The natural log properties are exactly the same as the log properties. Um, so when looking to expand something, the first thing I want to do is I notice that this whole um, this whole expression is is taken to the fourth root. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to rewrite this as ln two x cubed times x squared plus three. This whole thing is raised to the one fourth. Now, using this property, I know I'm going to have to put this one fourth to the front, right? So now we're actually going to have to start using some brackets. So now I have one fourth log, I'm sorry, ln, ln of x cubed times x squared plus 3. Now I see I have a multiplication problem going on. So therefore now I know that I have multiplication. So now inside the brackets, I can expand that further. So I have 1 4 brackets ln of x cubed plus ln of uh, x squared plus 3. Then I notice that since this is a square inside my ln, sorry, end bracket, I'm not going to put this exponent in front because it's going to be x squared plus 3 because it's not, this is not the square of my whole, um, whole function of improper my, in my natural log. However, this one is my whole um, term inside of here is being cubed, so I am going to have to put this in front. So my final answer would be 1 fourth. Ah. 1 fourth, bring the 3 in front, ln of x plus ln of x squared plus 3. So that's how you do the problem. So the main important thing is kind of start from the outside and work your way in. So that's how you uh, um, use properties of logs or natural logarithms to, ex to expand. Yes? Why don't you put the 2 of x squared in front of the, the other ln that you're adding? Because if you did, if you put that in front, right? When you put it in front, that means you put it in front of there, right? So therefore, if I was going to say, if you read this and you read it like this, 2, left, two ln of x squared plus, I'm sorry, of x plus 3, and let's say you, did, you had no idea. All you knew is, oh, I need to put that back up. Well, that would be x plus 3 squared, right? So you, there's no way to differentiate between the x and the 3. Okay. 